بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم ہاؤ آر یو ویورس ہوپ یو ول بی فائن اینڈ ٹو ڈے وی کم وتھ اے نیو ویڈیو نیو انفارمیٹو ویڈیو دیٹس اباؤٹ دا فراک اینڈ وی ول ایکسپلین دا سسٹمز ان دا فراک سو فسٹ وی ٹاک اباؤٹ مارفولوجی مارفولوجی از دا اسٹڈی آف دا ایکسٹرنل کیریکٹرسٹکس آف لیونگ آرگنیزمس اٹ کنٹینس آئی nostril, tympanum, digits, front leg, web feet, hind leg, belly, trunk, and head. This is morphology of a frog. If we talk about phylum chordata, it's divided into three subphylums. Eurochordata, sphelochordata, vertebrata. Vertebrates contain agnathans and gnathostomata. Agnatha contains class ostracodermy and class cyclostomata. While gnathostomata superclass Pisces and tetrapods, Pisces contain placoderme class Ostichthys, while superclass contains class Amphibia, Avis, class Reptilia, class Mammalia. Classification: Kingdom Animalia, Phylum Chordata, Subphylum Vertebrata, Section Gnathostomata, Superclass Tetrapoda, Class Amphibia, Order Renura, Family Ranidae, while genus is Rana and species is tigrina frog rana is most common species of frog bufo is common species of toads toad have poison glands but absent in frog cold blooded means their body temperature varies they have ability to change the color that's known as mimicry not seen in summer summer sleep estivation winter hibernation external morphology contain head trunk limbs its legs tail or neck region that's the external morphology of frogs uh, that's common in all type of frogs that's the external morphology head contains triangular and clonical steps snout mouth nostrils eyes tympanic membrane and vocal sacs now mouth cavity contains esophagus opening, vomerine teeth, internal nares, ostean tube opening, tongue and glottis. We have told you the parts on the mouth cavity. Now I will try to explain these parts and their functions. So, esophagus is the tube that connects mouth and stomach in frog, tympanic membrane, the aerodrome receives sound waves, glottis is the opening from mouth into respiratory system, tongue. Structure attached to front of mouth, extended to catch insects, maxillary teeth found in frog's mouth, holding the capture, vomerine teeth, nectating membrane, transparent part of frog eyelid and trunk. Frog is a tetrapod, forelimb present and dorsal part of trunk and in four limbs, four in number, thumb is absent, hind limb five in number, large muscular thumb, limb. Internal morphology of frog, respiratory system, digestive system, excretory and refractory. This is the picture of digestive system that contains gallbladder, esophagus, liver, stomach, intestine, rectum, cloacal aperture, urinary bladder, ureters, cloaca and the last one is cloacal aperture. This, these are the parts of digestive system. Their function. Large intestine, posterior organ which stores undigested food, liver secretes bile, processes digested food, urinary bladder collects and stores urine, fat body is needed for hibernating and matting, spleen stores, makes destroy blood cells, cloaca product of frog digestive urine pass when discharged from the body. This is the digestive system that is found in the frog to help the food to be digested now nose skin lungs pharynx these are the respiratory parts now its function three types of respiration cutaneous pulmonary and buccal respiration 35 percent cutaneous 56 percent pulmonary respiration and most you can say the buccal cavity respiration is above nine percent now we talk about the brain in these parts olfactory nerve olfactory lobe cerebral hemisphere 
choroid or plexus, optic lobe, cerebrum, posterior choroid, plexus, and medulla oblongata, infundibulum, pituitary gland, and optic chasma. This is the dorsal and the ventral view of brain of frog. So it can help you. Now we talk the functions. Cerebellum influences balance and equilibrium. Medulla oblongata involuntary functions helping cranial nerves that lead to and from the brain. You know these are the parts of a brain that helps the frog to maintain their balance. Spinal cord, main pathway, spinal nerves, olfactory lobes, these are all parts of brain. Now we talk about circulatory system. It contains carotid artery, systematic artery, palmocutaneous artery, anterior vena cava, posterior vena cava, right atrium, left atrium, sinus venosis, conus arteriosus, and spiral valves and sino sinal opening circulatory system contains heart arteries veins capillaries limb space arteries are the blood vessels that carry blood from heart to other organs vein carry back from other organ to heart and capillaries lead to other parts ovaries oviducts testes pumps seminal vesicles these are the Reproductive parts, ovaries are female reproductive system producing eggs. Ovi ducts are the female frog that carries eggs from ovary to colaica. Testes is male sex organ that carries sperms, and sperms are gametes, manual vesicles. Urinary ducts are the tubes in frog carry urine from kidney to cloaca. Urinary bladder organ that collects, stores urine until released adrenal glands organs located near the kidneys which secrete hormone ova or eggs or the female sex cells or gametes please subscribe our channel on the youtube science info for more informative messages or information so subscribe our channel science info thank you for watching us